Now, according to a source, and when I say source, I mean the Kardashians, since Kanye didn't go to two of his kids' birthday parties last year, they don't have any idea which events Kanye is going to go to. Now, I don't know what that has to do with giving him the address to the party this year, but we gonna get to the bottom of it right now. Make sure you like the video and subscribe. Now, this source that I'm assuming is a Kardashian, or like the article says, somebody close to the Kardashians, is basically trying to tell us the truth behind what Kanye was saying in that video when he was alluding to the fact that Kim isn't allowing him to see his children or at least go to that birthday party, all right? So the article says this. Earlier today, Kanye West made a video saying that his estranged wife, Kim Kardashian, was keeping him from attending their daughter Chicago's birthday party. We spoke to sources close to Ye and Kim to get both sides of today's ordeal. Sources close to both Kim and Kanye tell The Shade Room it was Kanye's idea to have two separate birthday parties for Chicago. Our source says it was news to Kim when he went on live today to say he didn't have the info and that he wasn't allowed to go when it was his idea to do the two separate events, Kim at 12 p.m. and Kanye at 4 p.m. Now, I want to stop for one second right there. Now, if he knew about all of this and it was his idea to have two separate events, then why didn't he have the info? And see, this is why a lot of people are hearing this story and they think it to themselves, oh, this is Kris Kardashian or Kim Kardashian or whoever in her camp trying to clean up and, you know, do uh, damage control, you know, trying to make sure, oh, don't put the blame on Kim. It's Kanye West's fault. But I think if you got common sense, you would have to ask if he knew about all of this and he had the information and he had his own separate party at 4 p.m., then why didn't he have the address? Like, you got to tell me that. Why, okay, you said it's a it was a surprise to you. It's a shock that, you know, he didn't have the info. But explain why he didn't have it. Just don't leave that blank. But let's continue. Another source shares that she, Kim, is trying to create boundaries and would like more privacy. It has nothing to do with co-parenting co or other kids. Now, you see, that's where this gets truthful. Because how do you go from kids' birthday parties to, oh, well, she's trying to create boundaries Okay, so basically, she was trying to create boundaries by not letting him go to his kid's birthday party. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you tell us a lie at first up here, and then right after that, you tell us the truth, that Kim wants to create boundaries. You know, it's like, come on. Obviously, she wanted to create boundaries. That's why he didn't have an address to his kid's birthday party, and that's why we haven't seen Kanye with his kids publicly since... Kim and Kanye got a divorce, but let's continue. Now, in addition, the source claims that the Kardashians have no way of predicting which events he wants to be invited to because Kanye didn't show up to Chicago nor Psalm's birthday party last year, nor show up on Christmas Day. Now, come on. He's Kanye West. I'm pretty sure he's missed events in his kids' lives. Just like his mother has probably not been there for every single event in their kids' lives. They are two of the most famous people in the world, okay? This don't tell me that Kanye is a bad father because he missed a birthday party, okay? And when they bring up Christmas Day, I remember Kim making a big deal on social media about Kanye having a Christmas stocking at their house, even though they were going through a divorce. So at that moment, it seemed like Kim was trying to make it seem like, you know, her and Kanye were doing a good job of co-parenting. But to me, I'm thinking to myself, oh, you were trying to save face 
So maybe later on you can bring up, well, he didn't show up on Christmas and I put up a stocking. So, you know, that's Kanye being a bad father. It just don't, it don't make any sense to me. Okay. Let's continue. They add that Kim has always protected Kanye in an effort to protect the kids by dealing with their private issues and has never gotten in the way of allowing him to see his kids and makes every effort to give him full access to them regardless of what he wants the public to believe. <sighs> Number one, Kim. When they were saying Kanye was on all of these drugs and that he's crazy and he's going in and out of the hospital, when were you protecting him then? I, I just want to know. For the last couple of years, I never saw Kim Kardashian get in front of a camera or make it known that she was 100% behind Kanye West and trying to help him, you know, get over whatever he was going through. Now, I don't know if he had, you know, mental issues he was dealing with. I'm not a doctor, but I will say it seemed like when he was going through a lot of the stress over the last couple of years, we never saw Kim. We only saw Kim when he was running for president. We saw Kim when he was, you know, doing the church thing and going to all of these churches, she would show up for that because those are the good moments. But in the hard moments, you never saw Kim. I, I never saw Kim. Now, I don't know them personally. You know, maybe she was doing a lot behind the scenes, but I think being publicly there for your husband, you know, means a lot. And when I don't see you, it says something to me and the rest of the public, okay? Um, and even this story coming out, it's like, how are you protecting Kanye right now? And if you always been somebody who want to keep stuff private, then it shouldn't matter if Kanye put out that video. So now you want to play tit for tat. But remember, Kanye in his video said, baby mama's been playing games grandmama's been playing games so his video was a response to something you did at least according to kanye <sighs> like i told y'all yesterday in all the videos i made about this because i think i made at least what four or five videos about this subject don't forget i'm the hardest working youtuber on the platform don't nobody upload more than me i just had to you know toot my whistle for a little second pause um but it just looks messy it just looks messy man and when i didn't see kim anywhere near kanye at that birthday party yesterday it said to me that yeah they have a lot of issues and they they need to try to figure it out for the kids man they're too blessed to not figure out a way to co-parent in my opinion, it don't have nothing to do with money and fame, but they're blessed to be in situations where, you know, they can make accommodations to make this work. If you ask me, um, make sure you like the video, subscribe is Kanye West at fault here or is it Kim Kardashian? Let me know in the comments. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.